Hello everyone, in this video today I have a review of the scan doubler prepared by ACID Maker. The device allows you to connect retro computers and consoles to a modern monitor or TV set. The device was released by Lotark and is being sold at RetroHex. I bought my Medusa in pre-order. The device is very solid. It's closed in the metal case. It has three navigation buttons and an LCD screen. All information displayed on the LCD also visible on the monitor screen. The device has a SCART input and a DSAP. Connect the sound with a jack plug. We connect Medusa to the monitor via digital DVI or HDMI connector if we use an adapter. The sound is connected to the Medusa with the jack plug. Computers and consoles are supported by composite as video or RGB signal. Depending on your needs, connect the appropriate adapter to the SCART connector. Medusa is powered via the USB connector. The device is easy to configure. The menu is very intuitive. We have all the necessary functions for screen settings. We configure all settings using three function buttons. In my opinion, it's worth having Medusa. I have much more complicated iXRGB FrameMaster device. iXRGB costs twice as much but has remote control, more input and output connectors. Additionally, you can save hundreds of computer and console settings. The Mini itself has more settings, however, the quality of the generated image compared to Medusa is very similar. Medusa has one technological advantage. Switches the image between changing resolutions much faster. iXRGB technology was only available in Japan and it's no longer productive. Rate the picture quality yourself against these devices. The comparison can be seen on 8-bit Atari, Amiga or Atari Jaguar. I leave you alone with this comparison. Uh, Says the quality of the image generated by both device yourself. Regards and see you in the next video material. Take care.